Yo, what's up guys? It's Joe P Gamer here today and in today's Grand Theft Auto 5 video I'm actually going to show you an awesome new unlimited money glitch after the patch of 1.24 and 1.26. Now before we get into this video guys I actually want to give the founders some credit. Now the founders are actually Be More Pro Gamer, uh, Slicker Trick and also Brandon something uh, but make sure you go and check them out down in the description below. Now basically this is quite difficult but easy at the same time. Now before we get into this video guys let's try and get way over 80 likes guys that'd be absolutely amazing and if you guys are new to my channel make sure you do subscribe for the latest and the best Grand Theft Auto 5 content so yeah let's begin so basically this is kind of like a card duplication glitch but you can't actually give your cards to friends you can only like you know keep it for yourself but basically all you're going to want to do is you're actually going to want to start up the Fleeker bank heist if you've actually completed all the heists now when you've done that all you actually want to do is you basically before you actually do any of that you want to actually bring out a car you want to make sure that you have the Fleeker bank heist already there though and you want to make sure that you drive the panto out so you want to make sure that you have a garage so you want to have two apartments like you can see you want to have like apartment three or say like apartment five and you want your apartment three to have like rebels and stuff like that in and then the bottom one which is obviously some like apartment five have stuff like the cars that you want to duplicate so I'm duplicating the panto now when you've done that what you want to do is you want to drive out your panto and then when you basically you want to drive it to the actual you know door of the uh, eclipse towers and then what you want to do is you want to get out and go to the actual fleeker bank heist start it up and you want to actually start it up in hard and actually invite your friend so then basically what should happen is your panto should actually spawn outside like you can see then all you want to do is you want to actually drive it in and actually replace it with one of the rusty rebels in the other garage like you can see now when you've done that, all you actually want to do is then tell your friend to kill himself and then basically when you've done all that, you just want to basically restart the actual heist like you can see and then when you've actually come back in, you'll actually notice that your panto's not there so what you want to do is you want to bring up your interaction menu and you actually want to go on to request personal vehicle like you can see and then what you want to do is you want to actually get into your car so basically the panto and you want to actually go back and drive it into the original garage that your panto was actually in and what it should do is it basically should teleport you inside the actual other garage where you can you know replace the other cars and where the other panto is then all you want to do is replace that panto with another car and bam you will have two pantos and it is pretty cool guys uh, as basically you can keep doing this guys and just get shit tons of money now you need to have two apartments in the same complex you need a friend and you actually need to have the uh, you need basically need to do this timing right and you just need to get it right in your head because it did, did take me a couple of times to actually get this right so guys if you guys went on to enjoy today's video let's try and get way over 80 likes guys that'd be absolutely amazing and if you guys are new to my channel make sure you do subscribe for the latest and the best grand theft auto 5 content so guys hope you enjoyed this video guys remember to go like subscribe guys and have a good day